Today, I'm talking with Dr. Ben Wellings and Monash student Hamish Galbraith about our Bachelor of Politics, Philosophy and Economics, otherwise known as the PPE. Ben is the PPE's course convener and Hamish is a current student. So who better to give us the 411? Let's get started. Hamish, why did you choose to study the Bachelor of Politics, Philosophy and Economics at Monash? So in year 12, I had a pretty clear idea of what I wanted to do. I was doing Global and Echo, and I was really enjoying those too. So I knew that that's where I wanted to go in uni. And when I found out about PPE at Open Day, it allowed me to study those two things that I was really keen on whilst bringing that third element in philosophy. The PPE is a program built for deep thinkers who want to make a difference. What are some of the vital skills that students obtain in this multidisciplinary degree? Well, PPE is ideal because it gives you a whole range of skills across the three disciplines. And these are uh, broadly under the uh, heading of critical analysis. So you'll be able to take a real world problem and then you apply the concepts of politics, philosophy and economics and you look at it from those three different angles. And this gives you a range of, of skills both on how to analyse data, how to communicate pers arguments persuasively, how to use logic and reasoning. And, and they're really the kind of skills that people need when they push out into the world, and in, particularly into the world of public affairs. And that's where they're going to end up working, uh, in business, in government, uh, in corporate uh, entities. So it's a, it's a really strong skills-based degree uh, that can provide a lot of job opportunities for graduates. We live in a 24-hour news cycle with greater access than ever before to information about local, national and global political and economic developments. In this environment, why do you think it's important for young people in particular to have an understanding of how political and economic power players operate? Mm -hmm. um, something I've been hearing a lot of on the news recently is like economic and political power players talking about decisions they're making being generational. So I think it's really important that we understand those issues and the decisions that are being made and the ramifications that we may not see for another 10 years or so, especially around climate change, which is an issue that our generation is going to have to face. Ben, the PPE offers a range of unique specialisations designed to empower students to hone their expertise in areas of interest. Can you tell me about the specialisations on offer and why they represent such a fantastic element of this degree? The the. Discipline specialisations in PPE, that is to say politics and governance, economic analysis and philosophy, are tailor-made for the degree. Having these distinct areas of specialisation really allows students to elevate their area of expertise uh, and choose a, a path of study that they are super interested in and really keen to develop. Hamish, what PPE specialisation have you chosen and why? So I think a specialisation in politics is going to give me um, the best base to reach my goal, which is to hopefully work for an NGO like Amnesty International. And then from that, I'll be able to incorporate my skills in economics and philosophy to further me in that career. Can you tell us about the study abroad and internship components of the course and why these elements are valuable for participating students? Study abroad and internships are a really important and integral part of the PPE degree. The study abroad really opens up students to different parts of the world and different perspectives on the world. And as we're entering into a phase where there are global pandemics, uh, climate change, um, even though we're seeing in some areas a kind of a retreat uh, away from globalisation, it's very important that graduates still have a global perspective because this is where the solutions to some of the big, big problems uh, in, in the contemporary public life are going to, to be found by acting both at the global level and more locally. The Victorian Parliamentary Internship is a really excellent opportunity uh, for Monash students and uh, each year we send a group, a competitively selected group of students to work with a Victorian MP on uh, an, an issue of concern to that MP and it gives actual practical experience where you can take the skills that you've learned in the PPE degree in the lectures in the tutorials, in the workshops, and then you see how those apply in a day-to-day -day working in a parliament. Not only does it set you apart in terms of your CV when you come out the other end of it, but it just helps you see what the whole degree has been about. What exciting professions can PPE students dive into? 
there are lots of exciting professions that a PPE graduate will be um, well equipped for. There's politics and government, there's the public service, there's multinational corporations and, and lobbying and anal an analysts, there's working for non-government organisations, NGOs, journalism teaching. There's lots that PPE graduates can do. What all these careers have in common is that they are about affecting change. So a PPE graduate will enter their career with the capacity and the capability to affect change. And as they progress through their career, they will more and more become the agents of change, the people who are going to uh, address the current problems uh, and affect solutions. What advice would you give to any incoming PPE students looking to get the most out of the university experience and craft an extraordinary career? The advice I would give an incoming PPE student is to uh, develop ma and maintain networks. When you step out of the PPE degree, you'll be one of a cohort of PPE, Monash PPE trained students, uh, and, and this in itself will become uh, a network. Be social uh, and maintain those networks. The advice I'd give to anyone coming into the degree would be to take all the opportunities that present themselves, especially the ones that are unique to the PPE degree. I'm really looking forward to the Global Study Tour next year and really looking forward to getting involved with the parliamentary internship and any other internships that present themselves.